Good day everyone! Welcome to CJ Diaries! So, so anyway, today we were given a task by our professor and in this video, you'll get to know more about me. Ayan. So as I have said, you'll be knowing something about me. So to start, watch this. My name, my age, my favorite color, my height, my sign, do I have a lover? What's my nationality? Here's some things that inspire me. So those are just basic information about me. So regarding my teaching job, so I have been teaching for almost seven years, four years in the private school, and then going three years in the public school. So, so far, I have been enjoying the job, though sometimes mahirap naman talaga siya. Wala namang bagay na madali. So it's just uh, a matter of enjoying what you do. So, so in this part of the video, you'll know about three things about me, interesting things about me. So number one that I will be sharing to you is, um, one, I love to cook. Konti lang kasi nakakaalam na marunong at saka mahilig akong magluto. Usually kasi ang alam nila, mahilig lang akong kumain. But I love to cook. Usually. So second thing na isi-share ko sa inyo na interesting about me is, uh, aside from being a student and a teacher, I'm also a writer. So, it's been almost two years na ako nagiging writer sa isang publishing house. And third interesting thing about me na share ko sa inyo is mahilig ako mag-tiktok. Ayan. So, nahilig lang naman ako nitong nag-quarantine. And usually, na ginagawa ko sa tiktok is more on dances. So, yung mga tiktok. Do up a do up shoo video. So at this point, marami na kayong alam tungkol sa akin. So you have known some basic information about me and three interesting things about me. So at this point, I'll be sharing to you the three goals I have, why I have enrolled in this subject. Anyway, ang subject ko ngayon is educational models, paradigms, and procedures. I only have three goals in this in enrolling in this course. And first, that is to learn. To improve and to adapt. So, in the last part of this video, I'll be sharing to you my idea about an educated Filipino. So, for me, there are three things that an educated Filipino must have. Number one, he or she must be able to show good conduct. Number two, he or she should be able to display or portray good values such as respect and discipline. And number three, an educated Filipino must be able to exhibit patriotism and nationalism, love for country. But it is of how you carry yourself, how you deal with people, how you play your role as a Filipino citizen, being productive, and abiding with the laws and your responsibilities, being a Filipino citizen. So that is what an educated Filipino firm. So that is all for today. You have already know about me, the three interesting things about me, my goals why I enrolled in this course, and my idea of an educated Filipino. So I will see you next week on CJ Diaries. Bye!